Sponsored by Bangta, Sustainable Business Development in Harmony with the Environment and Society. The materialization of the integrated business community is set to bring in both huge opportunities as well as challenges for many study fields. And today, in this episode of Towards 2015, we will explore what is expected for the education business as we brace for the coming changes in the economic environment and what has been done through the years through the eyes of Bangkok University. Welcome to Towards 2015, the program that will bring you the updates about the happenings around the region regarding the upcoming AEC, the ASEAN Economic Community. And uh, one of the important aspects is about human resources, building up human resources. And in, in the wake of that community building, today joining with me is Dr. Martana Sattiwat, the president of the Bangkok University. Thank you for giving us the time. With talk. pleasure. Okay. Uh, Professor, so um, with the coming, uh, building up the community of the AEC, uh, with the, do you think that the integrated economy will help enhance the uh, education business in Thailand? In, in what way? I believe so, because as you may know, numbers of the populations of the AEC or, or 10 countries of ASEAN are more than uh, 600 million mm -hmm. and that will generate more of the movement of uh, the students and also uh, laborers and also others like professors and tourists also. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think numbers of the people will move around these regions very much and that will generate the economics of these regions. So how is the Bangkok University preparing for this coming ASEAN economy, uh, for the ASEAN economic community? Uh, since the Bangkok University is the private university and uh, it is the largest private universities in Thailand, uh, caught by enrollment. So I think the one of the things that is very important for the higher education institutions is to prepare the curriculum in order to come up with the numbers of the qualified with qualities of the graduate from the universities. So for the university, the first thing that we do is, since we have the <coughs> international college, uh, which we use the English as the medium of instruction, <coughs> and we have done the international program for more than uh, 20 years now. Mm -hmm. So uh, we try to revise and prepare more of the curriculum. And also the other thing is the environment. Right now we focus, we have a new vision of the university, uh, try to promote the creativity because we feel that uh, in order to boost the uh, economics of the countries, the knowledge, ba uh, knowledge base society is one of the things that we would like to try to make it happen. Mm -hmm. So uh, the creativity is part of that, that uh, will bring the, uh, the visions come true. So uh, we try to uh, provide the curriculum and also some of the majors that uh, the students may have an opportunity to uh, use the creativity and can build their uh, knowledge and also can uh, have the experience from studying from the university and also from the industry. 
So besides that curriculum, which we call the uh, creative curriculum, we provide the creative environment also, uh, which you may know the environment of the university, uh, not just only the laboratory, but also the scenery, the buildings and the facility, all facility. We try to make it uh, as the creative uh, environment so the students will experience from uh, the environment of the university so also. They're, they're encouraged to be more creative. Yes, right, right, right. And other than that, we try to provide the opportunity for creativity, which is uh, we offer the uh, scholarship, mm -hmm. uh, which we call the creative scholarship for the students who may uh, come in uh, and having uh, study in any fields, but having the opportunity to uh, create the projects. And we fund it. Uh, if we feel that there's the possibilities of that creativity will uh, be the, uh, the uh, successful project, something like that. Yeah. Uh, can you give us an example of the curriculum that you're talking about? Uh, in, in what area is it focused that you have to adjust it so then it mm -hmm. goes well with the mm -hmm. classroom? Right now, we know that uh, we, we have one of the program that we uh, just start this year, uh, which is the uh, School of Architecture, uh, which you may know it is part of the one of the uh, seven profession that will be opened uh, due to the AEC. Uh, so we start this program this year, this year, but uh, we have the uh, some program like in the interior design that we have done for many years in the School of Fine and Applied Arts. So we move uh, that majors to the new School of Architecture. This is one thing. And the other thing is that uh, this building is the Tourism Tower building at Rangsit Campus, which uh, we built it for, especially for the tourism airlines and hotel uh, studies. So uh, this is to prepare the student to study in the field of uh, tourism, which uh, is part of the professions uh, will be opened due to AEC2. Mm -hmm. So this is the place where the students will have an opportunity to experience from uh, the real for example, the real uh, airline mock-up, which uh, we use the uh, 738 or seven, uh, the uh, dream liners of the uh, uh, Thai Airways International that uh, will be having uh, next next year's right. mm -hmm, the new airline. Mm -hmm. So we use that as the mock-up for the airline business uh, majors and also uh, for the uh, kitchen or the restaurant and also the kitchen, we have the uh, experimental kitchens and kitchen studio that uh, the student will have the, uh, some of the uh, chef or the people who uh, can uh, maybe coming from other countries to perform in the uh, teaching class or cooking class, the students will have an opportunity to learn from them uh, through the uh, uh, excellent facilities. And other than that, we have uh, the program in FIM, uh, FIM uh, which is the program that right now is very popular. <clears throat> the student uh, will have an opportunity to use the new facilities in the uh, the uh, we call the Cinematic and uh, Digital Arts Center that we built uh, in this campus also. The student will have an opportunity to learn and uh, the theme is one of the things that we call is part of the creative curriculum also. Mm -hmm. 